Welcome back to day one of the world famous mining show in Toronto, Ontario. Now we have the privilege of hearing our first graphene story of the week, Francis Dubé from Zen Graphene. Um, by way of corporate history, there was some corporate activity, new board, new management. You have a large project in Northern Ontario called the Albany Project, discovered about 10 years ago. But the new team has done some really exciting things. So first tell us about graphene, then we'll talk about the things the team has done. Yeah, so graphene is a new wonder material. It's 200 times stronger than steel, conducts heat 10 times more than copper, conducts electricity 1,000 times better than copper. Is it naturally occurring or does it have to be man-produced? Um, you can actually do it two ways. You can take graphite and break it down into its layers or you can do what's called carbon vapor deposition where you actually build it up. But when you do it that way, the costs are a lot higher. Okay. So if you want to talk industrial processes, um, you won't be able to get the industrial pricing down to where it needs to be with the CVD process. So that's why we're uh, really excited about what we have as a graphite deposit okay. and making graphene industrial scale, industrial pricing. So it, it's a cousin of a diamond, right? It's just carbon. Absolutely. It's a diamond that didn't grow up. Correct. So See? diamond is carbon in 3D, we're carbon in 2D. What new projects do you have underway? So last week we just launched a new web store. So we've been telling folks for a long time so that we... You're selling graphene online through a web store. Correct. Are, first ones in the world? No, no, there's others. There okay. is others. First in Canada. All right. Um, but the others are like the big research group, the Sigma Aldrich out there, the ACS. So right. uh, we're the first ones that if we had a company work with us and said, this works great in our process, can you sell us tons of it? We could say yes. Wow. If you went to Sigma Aldrich and says, yeah, I need uh, you know, 10,000 tons of this material, um, they don't do that. They just make chemically perfect products, basically. So it's oh. a very different story for us. So it, Graphene then is similar to the rare earths, and most of the rare earth companies seem to partner with universities or research institutes around the world. That's correct. You can't be any different. We're very similar there. Who's your teammate? We've got two of, of two of them that are very active right now. We're working with a few others as well, but Guelph University and the University of British Columbia are, are the two biggest ones right now. Now, a press release went out announcing the relationship up in Guelph, and you have a facility opening up soon. Correct, yeah. When? Uh, grand opening is in two days. Pretty nice. exciting stuff. So what's this facility going to be for? Uh, production, research, development? A little bit of everything. So with our web store up now, people can actually buy our products, getting into more researchers' hands. So we're going to scale up our production methods. Right. Uh, we're doing it in universities before. It's kind of test tube kind of sizing. Uh, we're scaling that up right now. That's one of our biggest thing this year is really scaling up our processes. So that new facility will allow that. But we're also doing some R&D out of there as well. So pretty excited yeah. for that. I always enjoy my time with you. Thank you. Zen Graphene. Jeez.